Hi, my name is Claire and welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you know me, thanks for coming back. And if you are new, welcome. <laughs> Straight off the top before we get into it, this is my Patreon only merch. And if you want to support me on Patreon, please go to patreon.com forward slash because the link is down in the description. But if you're new here, which you might very well be, that might be because I've just been in a TV show that has aired in Ireland. This is cool because I like really have wanted to do commentary content for a while, but um, never had anything that I really wanted to do it on. And I was sure like an episode of me potentially embarrassing myself on national television is probably the best way to start. The show is called Eating with the Enemy and basically the premise is that you meet with somebody, you have dinner with them, someone on totally different, it doesn't have to be political, but a totally different ideology to you, the opposite end of the spectrum, um, and you try to have a conversation around your beliefs and try not to kill each other. <laughs> After we filmed the episode and I went home and thought about it, I think that I just got cast as like generic feminist and then I got paired with like generic misogynist. And I have watched two episodes of the show, not my episode, so far. And that just kind of does reinforce for me that in each episode there seems to be a sexist versus a feminist. So I think that I'm my episode's <laughs> feminist. Okay, so I really should have been recording on this mic from the start, but um, new to commentary. And also I need to listen to these earphones because otherwise it's going to be an endless feedback loop. And I didn't match my earphones to my hoodie the way I matched my eyeshadow to my hoodie, but it has worked out for me. <sighs> I actually, I feel sick. I've actually felt sick all day. You know, they rang me and they basically said, you know, maybe you'll want to make your social media private. And I was like, um, that's my job. Oh God, I'm the thumbnail. <laughs> I think one of the pairings has had more time in each episode than the others. And in the first three episodes, that particular pairing is the thumbnail. So I am the thumbnail of episode five. God, I'm so nervous. My stomach hurts. Okay, so we're just going to, we're going to go for it. Like what, what else is there to do, to be honest? It's okay, Claire, chill. I made a cup of tea and left it somewhere. I'm just after realizing I made a cup of tea so I could have a cup of tea during this. And where did I put it? It's gone. Let's meet our first candidate. Let's meet our first candidate, okay. Oh my God, it's me. Oh my God, why do I walk like that? I'd like to have a conversation with somebody who's willing to have a conversation. Oh my God, my arse. Why do I walk like that? I walk like someone who, who cuts wood. <laughs> Like a lumberjack. To be, uh, the shoes probably didn't help. <laughs> How are you? My name is Barry John. His name is BJ. Sorry, but it is though. So. Hi, Barry John. How are you? Nice to meet you. Barry John. Barry John. I like it. Two first names. You're very strange initials. People <laughs> <laughs> might have a certain perception of me okay. as maybe being uh, chauvinistic or something like that, but I don't think I am chauvinistic, to be honest. <laughs> so. <laughs> Fair enough, yeah. Fair enough, yeah. No idea what to say. Because we hadn't talked yet. How was I supposed to tell if he was fucking chauvinistic? We said two words to each other. Okay, so this is the next couple. And uh, no offense, but like we're going to skip that. Do you believe life is harder as a man or a woman? When they asked me this question, I was like, oh, fuck's sake. I don't think, as a rule of thumb, women are treated or have, have it harder than other people on my podcast he fucking promoted his podcast so much i was like i also have a fucking podcast <laughs> there is an awful lot of reaction shots of me i look good though the light worked for me on the bright side apart from the under eye bags <laughs> they're using so many reaction shots of me they've actually cut out quite a lot of what i actually said i definitely feel like i engaged him a lot more than is being shown here some people will think i'm a fucking bitch after watching this and some people will agree with my visual expressions <laughs> but so far the sound bites they've taken from me have been succinct and have made me sound smart and thank you very much to the editor of this show i'm fully willing and ready to take that back if that changes Oh my god, okay, it's back, it's back, it's back, it's back. Shh, 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 shh. Whoever edited this, they're fucking fire at editing. How is everything going at Claire and Barry John's table? And then cycle lanes everywhere can piss off as well. Like. Why? The cycle lane, I forgot about the cycle lane. I 
that wouldn't be something I thought the people would be vehemently against. I love how I was like, what? <laughs> when, he's like, when he was like, I don't like cycling lids. <laughs> I was like, what? I suppose the big turning point in my life would have been when my mother died. Here's the sad bit now. Um, and I often think about this and I wonder if she hadn't died, would it, like would I be the same person? And I genuinely don't know because I feel like it really pushed me out of the nest and it really made me... Out of your comfort zone. Yeah, 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 and it made me like stand on my own two feet. I didn't cry there, I'm crying here. He was so respectful and so thoughtful in the way that he let me talk. Um, and even his body language, his face was really kind and he was really letting me have the floor there. I think me and Brian John are best friends. Basically, I took on the life motto of, like, don't be a dick. Oh, they let me say don't be a dick on TV. Okay, so, so far, it's not so bad. It's touching. It's, I don't know what another word for touching is. <laughs> I love my little beta reactions. I'm like, <laughs> I want to be on TV more. Put me on TV more. I'm so cute. <laughs> I'm very happy with this so far. Okay, we're back. We're back. Eating with the enemy. God, this editor is absolutely unreal. Well, also the shots are unreal. Ooh, so if you were another gender tandem. for the day, what would you do? I'd, I'd be at home playing with myself. All day. <laughs> Let's say if I'm a female now for the day, <laughs> and if I want to go out there, I, I can go out and say, like literally, bang, bang, bang. As a woman on the internet who gets creepy messages all the time, I'm sure that I could get three dates a day if I wanted. Um, I think he was thinking quantity over quality there. I could, I could be with, I could be with a thousand people today, whereas we have to work for it. <laughs> I love that. They, they, there's loads of things he said where I laughed, and they just instead of my laugh, they put in a dead face. Amazing. People will think I'm a fucking bitch. This girl comes to walk out, and I was there going, that, that, that can't, that's not her. It couldn't be her. And my reaction face is. Did not look like the girl that was in the pictures okay. at all. It's good to know how expressive my face is when I'm taking in information. <laughs> this is good information for me to know. I asked her, did she want food? I knew she'd say yes to that. Oh my God. <laughs> Went out to get her food and I just left her in the cinema. <laughs> I drove home. I was like Michael Schumacher. Oh, Brian, Barry John, I miss you. We're obviously the comic relief in this episode, I think. Not that I've watched anyone else in this episode, but they all seem real serious looking when I... Skip through. Coming up. If something doesn't affect you, and if it's causing a hardship on somebody else, mind your own fucking business. I love how the, that sounds like he's giving out to me, but he's actually not. We were agreeing. I think that actually a lot of it has been cut out, um, which is fine by me. <laughs> Taking literally the best sentences, so we sound really smart. Yeah, I'm. I'm totally happy with how this is going. Shockingly, I think I made the right decision on what I was wearing. I wore a green blouse with a red strapped up underneath it. I wonder will anyone notice it's the Mayo colours. I did that on purpose. I like you. And like, I totally didn't expect to like you before this. Like I was saying I had like a nightmare. Like I totally thought we were going to be like fighting. And like, you know, I thought it was going to be maybe not a positive experience. I really liked him. Okay, so I am so relieved about how that came out. It is very surface level, but at the same time, like, the other people got into the deep shit. Me and BJ are just best mates. My best mate BJ. I shouldn't call him BJ. He likes to be called Barry John. I really liked him. And watching that has reminded me how much I liked him and how much we got on. And yeah, I would recommend you go watch the series. This is not, by the way, sponsored, just FYI. And I was not paid to appear in Eating with the Enemy. It was shot in December when we were loose our lockdown regulations. But as you can see by the length of the table, there was social distancing and all that crack and everyone wore masks and it was all, it was all above board. Yeah, look, I'm just really happy with how that came out. I was so nervous, so, 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 so nervous. I actually think Barry John came out really well out of that and I'm delighted for him because he needs a redemption <laughs> arc. I'm glad, I'm really happy for him that he's getting his redemption story and I'm happy to be a part of it and I think we were great friends on the day and I would still go for a pint with him. I said that on the day and I, I stand by it now. I would still go for a pint with him if the pubs were open. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe to the channel and let me know is there any other TV shows you want me to review? Um that don't have me in them <laughs> if you liked this video you might like this video or you might like this video 
um please subscribe to my channel thank you so much for watching please consider supporting the channel on patreon and i shall see you in the next video so on so on